Hello guys, this is the editor bringing you my first episode of Starbound. Let us begin. We'll create a new character. And let's see, who do we want this to be? We will be a human. And we will call him... Editor. Original. Don't you agree? Personality. Um, right here. Guns blazing. Let's get that pants. Nice shirt. Um, yeah, I like that. Hairstyle. We shall get a f an amazing hairstyle. That seems good. Uh, undie color. How are you supposed to know what color it is? Whatever. Let's get some nice black hair. There we go. Shirt color. That's awesome. He's in full leather. Okay, let's get started. Okay, here we are. So, there's our first quest. Let us get into our storage area, get our amazing stuff. Okay, so we have to make a crafting table. Excellent. Our broken hero sword. Awesome. So, we have no fuel. And here's the ship. Let's see, I just want to see. We could maybe go to the arid planet next. Yeah, that sounds good. Let's get down and see if our planet's beautiful. It's an ugly planet. We started in an ugly planet. Really? Oh, whatever. We'll just chop down some tentacle wood. Why are there normal trees on the background? I don't know if you can see it, but in the background, it, they're normal. Okay, this is taking forever. And it's going to timber. Excellent. Now let's get our wood. And let's start some crafting. We will get our crafting. Oh, we need one more. Beautiful. Okay, we'll do that quest. Now we need to get some meat. Ooh, I, I hear some baddies close by. Okay, let's get our sword out. Are these guys friendly? Nope. They are not friendly, and I'm going to die. And that's the end of me. Oh my god. What? That was BS. Okay. We're we're gonna go try again. You see me butt naked now? Well I have my underwear. Okay, we're gonna try that again. Okay. Okay, these Bulbasaur go- oh, it changed. Now, I am not taking any risks. Oh, those guys were okay. Oh, it's these- these SOBs. Dead. Okay, let's go. Ooh, Iron Ore. Go to hell. Okay, he's dead. Let's get us some stone. And then we'll mine some of that iron right there. Well, I, I, I love this game, really. I don't know about you, but it's a pretty peaceful, awesome game. Loving the music right now. Let's get that pixel. But I... We'll disable it, just so... Or lower it a little bit. Like... Right there. There we go. So I can hear myself think. Beautiful day in Tentacle Land. Uh, beautiful name for a planet, really. Tentacle Land. 
So we're going to have to get quite a bit of stone. I'm going to skip to the part where I get all the stone I need. Okay guys, we are back. Now let's get back to our crafting table. And let's get out of this planet as fast as possible, because it's horrible. Okay, so... We need to make some more wooden planks. Oh, we need to cut down... No oh my god, okay. A tentacle tree. I don't know how that works. A tentacle tree. And where these grew from. That'd be awesome, like, if you if you cut down a tree, then a giant boss, that's actually the entire planet, comes at you. The entire planet attacks you. That would be epic. Great, we have some more wood. Let's get this going. Beautiful, now we can make a pickaxe. So, pick. And what do we need? We need more of everything. That's okay. We can mine some stone right here. Quite a bit faster. Boom. Now, let's make our stone axe. Uh, we need one more wood plank. And we need to cut down another... Oh, thank God. Stone axe. We need one more cobblestone. So, um, some goals, of course we have to make the classic beacon to uh, summon the penguin boss guy. And for the beacon we need to go mining, which will be interesting in this planet. Quite an interesting planet, really. What? We have cobblestone. What is this then? If that's cobblestone, then what is this? It's dirt die oh my god. You kidding me? Oh shoot. I think uh, it's one of those asses again. Bulbous or whatever. Okay. Excellent. Let's go back to our stone quarry. Now let's get chop this down. Or mine it down. If you'd rather. Finally, okay, now let's get back. Ooh, it's getting dark already. Uh, that's probably friendly, I can tell. And let's make our freaking stone axe. Beautiful. Let's chop this down. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Okay, going out to the ship. Let me organize a couple things. Uh, that seems good. And I'll skip to the morning. Hey guys, we are back, and let's get some more wood right here quickly, and let's start building our mansion out of, out of, um, tentacles. Yep, exactly. <clears throat> We're destroying the environment here, with good reason, this environment sucks, and, uh, we, let's get that iron that we found over there. Don't fall into the pit of death. 
And let's start mining. You guys okay? I'm gonna kill you. Wait, wait, no, I'm not gonna kill you. Okay, let's get this iron. Sweet. Corrupt dirt blocks, that's the soil. Awesome. That's why we have to get out of here as quickly and painlessly as possible. <clears throat> now we got some iron. Let's, uh, ooh, we need some more stone actually, cause to make a furnace. Great. Now, let's get out of here. And start our beautiful base. Furnace, right? Oh, what a, I can't fire. Almost forgot. And we need more cobblestone. Okay. So then we will be ready to roll. Okay guys, I'm back and while we're while we're setting things up, I have a funny story to tell you. In fact, it's kind of hilarious. I read this from a book, The Darwin Awards, if you've ever seen it. And it's about a couple, right? And they went up to a mountain and they started making out, you know? And once they started making out, which they were on top of a large hill, uh, a lightning storm s started basically, right? And they were outside of their car lying down on the grass and you probably can tell what they were doing and all of a sudden lightning hit them right which caused the guy and his you know sensitive parts to stick to the girl yeah now that instantly killed the girl right but the guy was still alive so this guy was stuck to her right and and he couldn't escape and there was a lightning sword going on and his sensitive parts were melted, and it was just horrible for him. And his girlfriend was dead, right there. Now, he couldn't get out, he cried for help, but no one came. Uh, he couldn't get up with the girl, because the girl was stuck to the ground. So it was just a horrible mess, but to make matters, to make that horrible, disgusting situate Bird, shut up, I'm telling you a story. To make that horrible, disgusting situation a million times worse, a bear. Okay, a huge grizzly bear comes along, right? He's lumbering all over the place, right? And then he starts eating his girlfriend's face in front of him. And and the guy's still alive, remember? And the girl's dead. So he's eating his girlfriend's carcass. And he's right there, feeling the hot breath of the bear. To, to make all of this worse. And it, basically, he chews off her face, right? To the horror... Oh, what an ugly creature. To the horror of the guy, right? And after he basically eats her face off, the bear walks away, and he's stuck there for the entire night until a Girl Scout troop climbing up the mountain happens to spot the naked guy, right? And his life is saved, and now he has melted private parts in a scarred mind. I mean, if that happened to me, oh, ugh. I'd, I'd probably just cut myself... No, I, I don't know if I would cut myself free, because I might remove more than I have to. But that's just a disgusting story. Uh, what would you guys do? I mean... I... I That'd be freaky. If there was a bear there, I mean, I'd probably... I have no idea what I would do, really. Uh, it's pretty depressing, really. I mean, sometimes stuff like that happens, and you just have to... In to live with it okay so we're gonna get some bandages and also some much needed uh, plant fiber for a bow sweet it's pretty dark here 
We'll use the old jumping technique. Now, another thing I want to talk about is... I don't know if you guys heard about the game Towns. A game on Steam, like a city building game. And, I mean, it had a lot of potential, but I mean, if you go... If you go to Towns right now on Steam, and look at the comments, it's... There's, there was literally a 27 minute video some guy made of just scrolling down looking at all the thumbs down that the game received. 27 minutes worth of scrolling down a page. C can you believe that? I mean, that's pretty rough. I mean, I've played it before. It wasn't horrible, but I'm sure... But I stopped playing it a little while ago, but I'm sure many people were disappointed by how much progress it did not make. I mean, it had potential, definitely. So we're just gonna find a little creature, right, to murder. How about fly? Oh, come on. There we go. What the hell are you even? I'm gonna name you Fly. Creative, right? Oh, shoot. It's getting dark, it's getting dark, it's getting dark, it's getting dark, it's getting dark. We are running off, right? And we're gonna go up and we're gonna beam up. We're safe now. We just shoot up my own ship. Okay guys, so that's about it for today. I will see you on the next episode. This has been the editor, and if you like more content like content like this, and I don't just make Starbound, I make quite a variety of videos. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you later.